Maui Emergency Management Agency Administrator Herman Andaya has defended his decision not to sound sirens during the deadly wildfires that ravaged the island last week. Andaya said that the sirens are primarily used to alert people to tsunamis, and there was concern that sounding them during the fire would lead people to run toward the danger. Instead, Maui relied on two different alert systems, one that sent text messages to phones and another that broadcast emergency messages on television and radio. Since the sirens are primarily located on the waterfront, they would have been useless to people on higher ground, the decision not to sound the sirens has been criticized by some who believe that it could have saved lives. However, Andaya and other officials have defended the decision, saying that it was made in the best interests of public safety. The wildfires on Maui killed 111 people and destroyed more than 2,000 homes. It is the deadliest wildfire in Hawaii history. The state attorney general has ordered a comprehensive review of the emergency response to the wildfires, including the decision not to sound the sirens. The review is expected to take several months. Please subscribe. Share your thoughts and opinions and join the conversation.